Hi Andy, it's Phil Beaver here from the Wilderness Club. Just want to recap on a lesson this morning. So we run through your swing here on the left. We can see, unfortunately, the very first move of your hands is away from you. As you can see, your hands go slightly outside that blue line. What that's going to do is, unfortunately, even though this back swing is going to start to go more upright now, unfortunately, the hand path is going to sort of carry on this line and you're going to see that your swing gets a little bit too flat and low and deep. So we can see there, for me, the uh, it's, a just, it's just fractionally low, and It's not terrible. So if we look at this swing on the right, you'll see, first of all, your hands definitely move inside, but the club head stays outside, which is textbook. This is a really good move here compared to your swing currently. So we can have a look at that there. It's much tighter, and that left arm's a bit more across you, which I love. Okay, top of your swing from here, you obviously if you swing it flat, you're going to hit the uh, dry range. So we can see now the left arm's a little bit more vertical. So what we're looking at here is that the left arm would go above the ball, uh, but only just. We can see with yours, it, it flies way above, yeah? So that's the feeling. But look how much more width there is in your swing from there, Andy, okay? At the end of the lesson, we started to work on really just trying to hit a little cut. So... I want you to stick a stick in the ground in line with the ball and all I want you to do is feel like you start the ball just left of it and it will cut back. Keep everything else the same. You're trying to get this set and this backswing good but naturally Andy you do have this sort of fade release. We can see as you come down here coming into impact the club face is very very square there. If anything you're a little bit under it but it's because you're trying to hit a draw but you can see here the face just doesn't really do a lot so I like that. So instead of us trying to hit a draw and working way too hard, I mean, the face here is terrific. I think we just hit baby cuts. And what you did start to see is as you get the hands higher and actually start to start the ball just left the target and cut, we started to hit it sort of up on this sort of window, where earlier on a six iron was on that window. So just keep an eye on your swing. You'll notice it by flight. If the ball's coming out a bit low, we know you're swinging a bit flat. And the ball's coming out a little bit higher uh, with a bit of cut. We know you're swinging a little bit left and across it and hitting the right flight. I hope that all makes sense. Any problems, give us a shout.